Hey, welcome back to the channel, BMF Speed Shop. So I want to show you guys the best winter vehicle, the best winter vehicle ever created by man. And no, it's not that one. It's this 1989 Subaru GL Wagon, five speed, 4WD. So um, this vehicle here, I just picked it up, fresh out of a barn since 2017. She shows 271,000 miles-ish. I put about a thousand on it since I've gotten it. Let's do a little start here. When she first starts up, sometimes you have to give it a little bit of gas. So I got a new injector for it, new EGR valve, idle air control valve. Um, but man, this thing is clean, rust free. Um, the whole engine was just gone through by the previous owner. He took really good care of this car and um, fixing on it. New clutch, all new gaskets, new tires, new brakes, new wheel bearings. Um, so I'll give you guys a little tour. This is my new daily driver. He installed that nice little oil pressure gauge there. Um, he did a oil pump upgrade. He's got an alternator upgrade out of a Maxima, HID headlight upgrade. Um, I use this for my daily. Daily driver. Um, I got all my tools, jack, air compressor, everything in here. Um, for doing my like vehicle revivals and stuff. And uh, yeah, I, I, we just love this thing. I mean, I seen it on the old face face marketplace and uh, the driver's seat does need to get reupholstered. I'm actually gonna talk to the upholstery shop about that soon. And it shows a little paint fade um, in the clear coat I wasn't able to bring back. I did a full fluid film um, rust treatment on this thing so we can try to keep it rust free because this is pretty much my winter vehicle now um, I can't drive the Monty or any of the other stuff I had a lot of stuff going on um, project wise I got rid of a bunch of stuff and uh so I was looking for some new projects and this is what I came up with. I needed something, you know, we could drive every day. So you can see the fluid film. I went a whole gallon on this thing. So, I mean, I got it everywhere. But this thing's super nice. I still need to find that factory uh, spare tire that mounts up there. She's got the selectable 4WD. And uh, I thought I'd take you guys for a little cruise here. I don't know how this is gonna go. I do have to tighten up that power steering belt one. I mean, we're just getting the bugs worked out of this. Like I said, it was parked in a barn. Um, he brought it from California in 2017 and it's sat since 2017. And she's still cold, warming up and stuff, but man, this thing, you know, 90 horsepower and it is absolutely a blast to drive. Um, I got some hopes and dreams for the car of doing a 2.5 swap, maybe putting some boost in here, lift or lowered, um, 17 inch wheels, you know, the normal stuff, maybe 15 inch wheels. Um, it's really hard to find good snow tires for these 13 inches. But uh, thought I'd give you guys a little introduction. Thanks for thanks for watching, following, subscribing, and all that stuff. Um, for some reason, that little door lock state light stays on. I ain't quite figured that out. Um, he's got red LEDs all in here. Volunteers. Tunes work. I mean, 
what else does a feller need? I just needed a car to drive around, take the kids places, um, get parts, stuff like that. So yeah, I seen this. I got a really good deal on this car. I can't even tell you how much it is, but if I did, you probably wouldn't freaking believe me. Um, this thing was, he had it up for 4,500 and he had it for sale all year and nobody, nobody wanted it. She pulls pretty good. But uh, yeah, I got a bunch of plans for the stuff on the channel. Um, stay tuned. I should have some more stuff. I've been wanting to make this video for a while, but I've been super busy. So, um, yeah, thanks for, thanks for following. Um, remember BMF Speed Shop, you know where it's at.